Hey everyone, welcome to another market update. I'm Richard Faulkner and today I'm standing on Gosford's newest building, uh, Gosford Central. As you can see behind me, we've got cracking views on top of the rooftop terrace here. Uh, new owners will be moving into this next week. I'm sure they're really excited. So what's been happening in the last quarter has been really interesting. I'm calling it the ripple effect of COVID. What effect is that having on the property market? Well, residential houses, we're seeing real good volume of people coming through those properties. We're seeing multiple offers and we're actually seeing prices starting to increase. Strata apartments and townhouses have been okay. They've been steady, um, but seem to be holding their own. So what's been really interesting is the rental market. So earlier in the year, we were experiencing a bit of a glut, especially with all these new buildings in Gosford, a bit of an oversupply of stock. Now to put it in perspective, if you've been watching or reading my reports for the last few years, on average, there's always been about 100 properties available at any one time in Gosford. Now that has dropped by 70% in the last three months. And what we're finding, we're getting anywhere from 70, sorry, 20 to 70 groups through our inspections, and they're actually offering more money than what we're advertising the property for. So earlier in the year, you would see that we'd get anywhere from 360 to 420 for a brand new rental property. Now we're leasing these same properties out for 480 a week. So if you own a rental property right now, this is the perfect opportunity to increase those rental prices. So there you have it guys, that is the ripple effect of COVID. I hope you've enjoyed watching this market update and if I can ever be of any assistance with your real estate needs in the future, feel free to reach out. Otherwise, I look forward to seeing you out and about in Gosford next time. Take care, folks.